Hey everybody and welcome back to the old farm countryside factories edition. First of all, I just want you to see what sort of a stacking job I've done. So, it, you, you can see flour and, um, and biodiesel there and in this trailer here, if I can get back to it, we have our first load of bread. So we're going to head on up to the supermarket and we are going to sell all this produce if I can back properly. Um, so the plan is to sell all this then we're going to um, I think I'm going to try and well, first of all, let's just see what this is going to bring, eh? Um, just to let you know, I was going to put a, a video out on my Friday, which for a lot of you would have been Thursday, but just, well, you know what life is like. Um, yeah, just things get a bit difficult, and I played this for a good eight or nine hours, so... Um, okay, that's not letting me do what I want, but anyway. And basically, just to get to this point, I was um, doing a lot of rinse and repeat sort of stuff. Um, repurposing that field, those fields. Um, and yeah, just generally stuff that isn't really interesting to watch, but necessary to get done so um so yeah i i'm finding that factories although they uh, they can be quite profitable profit you can make money out of them um it just does take a fair bit of time and a lot of patience to do and you can't really do a lot of variety um, sometimes I think it would be better if you just, you grow your crops and you just sell them. Um, that, in my opinion, is a lot easier than building up your factories and, and yeah, just doing things like that. Um, also the thing with all, doing all this factory stuff. I hope they like uh, flatbread here. Um, with all the selling, all this factory sort of stuff, it just it does take um, a fair bit to unload all these different things. You need to have a fair bit of patience to dump stuff off, and yeah, it just it can just take time to sell things. Okay, we're up to $51,000 just in bread. Um, this is where I would make a joke about this being a lot of dough. Um, yeah, um, just to quickly show you, if I went to the right screen, um, as you guys saw, I did get rid of um, my petrol tanker, made a huge mistake, so I... I had to go and buy another one, but rather than buying a truck, I just bought a dolly to add on to the back of my um, tractors. Oh, I can't pick that up, can I? It It is a little bit easier, but it can also be a bit, a bit of a pain in the you-know-where. Come on. Clearly it doesn't want doesn't want to take this one. There it is. Okay, now to jump in the tractor here. Unload from there. Drop off that because I need it on the back. Once again, I am impressed with how I was able to actually stack all that. Um, oh, don't walk through my tractor. Yeah, I was impressed with it. Um, 
hopefully you guys are too. I really didn't think I'd get that much, uh, get much, get that much onto the trailer. Let's get to and just take off these straps. So I hope you guys have all been well and staying safe and all that sort of stuff. Um, okay. Now to watch my superb loading skills at work here. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to be running through people at the moment. Um, they're a little bit a pain in the backside anyway <laughs> there goes mistake number one um, how to do this maybe if I pull this forward a bit here I can get to it from the other side yeah just pretend that I'm not actually running through anyone. I know I'm that's what I'm pretending to do. Once again, because everything's so difficult to unload, it's just it's not a matter of just driving over and pushing unload. It's I actually I actually have to physically hold things over the sell point. It's not the easiest way to sell everything out of factories. Um, okay. Sorry for anyone who might be getting a little bit motion sickness. Little bit of motion. Anyone who might be getting a bit of motion sickness out of this. Um, let's just go a bit closer. Um, so this episode we've got to go get to and... Um, get all that sugar cane un uh, cut um, as you remember from last episode it got all planted will that can I get it can I can I can I is it gonna work would help if I could remember how to turn wheels okay so that started going according to plan I don't know how much longer I'll keep this factories up and running um, hopefully in FS22 that well because they're actually making FS22 to take factories I think it's going to be a considerably better system than what we've got on 19 um, factories in 22 are their own separate category rather than using um, rather than using animal pens which are what they currently go under um, okay. Now you'd think that these here would actually start um, unloading upside down, wouldn't you? Come on. Okay. See, once again, this is a downside to doing factories. You've got to be just in the right spot. For anything to work properly. Come on. It's just not working, is it?
Oh, it started working. No. This is just not working the way that I want it to, is it? Well, on the upside, with the small amount that we've actually sold so far, um, we have made over 82, 87 grand, so, you know, we can't really complain about that. Um... Okay, <laughs> finally. Alright, well, I think I might might do this in a bit of a time lapse now, so as that I'm not just chatting away while we're trying to get this all loaded. Um, Alright, so I'll just chuck you into a time lapse and I'll see you in a few moments. As you guys saw, that was a, uh, wasn't terrible. That was fun, he says half sarcastically. But on the other hand, that um, gave us a, over a hundred nine thousand dollars worth of or pounds worth of income. So, is it worth it? Um, I'll leave that in your your guys' hands. Um, to be blatantly honest, I'm wondering. I, I really don't think it is because in the I've had to do four or five um, large fields at least four or five large fields of canola to get the factories going then the costs of the diesel and um, and all that sort of stuff it, um, and that's just getting the biodiesel up and going then I've then in order to and then in order to get the um, flour mill up and going once again I've had to oh come on in order to get the flour mill up and running properly um, I've had to have at least five um, fields of of canola going so you know I don't think it's really worth it I could have sold all that canola and all that um, flour. I probably would have made even more money than that over the time. Um, anyone keep an idea of the cuddles or the crashes that I'm getting through? Because um, I think I lose count each each and every episode. I'm. I think I might almost get to the point where. I'll just um, I'll just reset uh, that blasted um, finally that weight I nearly got to and reset it. So um, let's take these tra yeah let's take these trailers down to the farm um, and then we'll think decide how we're going to go about. Um, getting all the sugar cane harvested. Um, we do have two options. We've got the self-propelled. Uh, yeah, we got the self-propelled version, or we've got the we've got the tractor-propelled version. Um, they can both be. They've both got their advantages and disadvantages. Okay, so we've also got this field here, re-drilled full of canola. Um, this series is really telling me, or teaching me, the value of workers. Because um, quite frankly, I don't like drilling, it appears. So, alright. Alright, so let's see. We've got under sugarcane technology, we've got that. 
Um, now we could hire that for only 17 grand. Um, go with a trailer hitch as well. Yeah, trailer hitch. And we'd still need to hire the, um, the trailer for it. Um, or we can get that there, which we'd, we would hire for considerably less. Um, only 969 you know, pounds. But that's... Uh, oh, sorry, that one. But that's only one metre. The other one's two. And to be honest with you, I don't... I think it's going to be too painful to go with one metre. So let's just... We'll just rent that. Um, it may be 17 grand, but we won't need need it for that long well famous last words um what trailer should we go um we'll just go with that one let's change up the color to uh, i do like my blues and yeah we'll leave that how it is and once again we'll just lease that all right so Shoot on over to the store. We'll just click our way through. And that that is our trailer and our um, sugarcane harvester. Why aren't you connecting it? And now we know the reason why I hire things. Let's get, let's go with that one. We'll just, again, hire that. Hopefully that one there will connect in. We're probably overkilling ourselves here with the size trailer, but. Really, I'm not doing too well with this. Let's... Okay. Back to that. So, that one didn't work. Let's try that one. I'm glad we made a lot of money out of... Um, out of everything, because... For some reason, this just isn't liking me, is it? Um, try that one. At this point, with only 82 grand left to go. Yeah. Looks like we will have to go to the monstrous one. Alright. Swallow the pride. Let's go back to that one. Actually, before we worry about that, let's see if we can see if this actually has a capacity of its own, eh? Um, I'm not actually too sure about that I, I really haven't done much in the way of um, sugarcane harvesting. So we'll just get this down to the farm.
Okay, so we unfold that. We turn on the harvester. Pipe out. What does that actually do? Okay. Um, lower the harvester. And I have no idea if this is filling up or just does that doesn't appear to be doing anything, does it? You know what? I let's take this up and grab tra uh, one of those trailers, and hopefully that might unload into one. Otherwise, we're just going to go get the one meter trailer, uh, one meter harvester, and <laughs> yeah, this sugar had better make a lot of money because I have wasted far too much money trying to figure out how to get the sugar cane harvested. Nope. Traffic jam there and it wasn't my fault for a change. Um, so, alright, around here. We will take yellow, just for the laughs. Okay. Kind of suddenly had a song in my head, you know, the, the song, and it was all yellow. Um, yellow. Yeah, terrible when it comes to songs getting stuck in the old earworms time to knock down another stop sign and of course run into a tree if I was the council around here I'd just completely get rid of the trees um, through here so far I think harvesting is going to be a lot easier than um, than planting and from what I understand you can um, okay. all right so that does have some capacity in it by the looks. Okay, so um, may end up having to get a worker onto that so as I can drive this next to it. Alright. Okay, so we we are getting some going. Um, just curious. I know I was curious about this earlier, but let's just see what will happen here now that we've unfolded it. It may yet hook up, which of course it doesn't. Okay, so we'll just get this going and it may tell us that it gets full, but anyway. Um. Alright. 
So I think I'll put you onto a time lapse once again um, while I get to and get all this done, or at least part of it done, and then um, then I'll do a cutscene and bring this back when it's done. It would also appear that this will empty into any form of trailer. I did not know that either. Um, it's strange that this doesn't actually have a capacity amount as part of it. Um, a lot of a lot of things do have a capacity. Um, Alright. Yeah, no worries. All right. It's time to just return this. Um, we'll do it one row at a time, eh? Garage. Let's just... And we'll get rid of that. And we'll just hire that. Oops, we purchased it, but anyway, that tractor should be, oh, I'll use that tractor. Looks like um, we now own a sugarcane harvester. All right. Um, we'll go get that together. Boy, I do... Uh, I do talk in a roundabout way quite an awful lot, don't I? I say to you, oh, I'll just do a time lapse here, or do, or do a cut scene here, and before you know it, I'm trying to figure things out. So, you know, back we come, we don't, we stay, we we go, we go left, right, all sorts of different places. But, you know, part of the fun of watching me, isn't it? Um, by now, we should should know what I'm like. Especially when I can't drive. Alright, so. Now this is probably the reason why a lot of people will stick away, steer away from doing sugarcane, to be blatantly honest, because it's not exactly an easy process. I um, think this is one of my first times of doing it. Um... And I'm only really doing it so as I can get the sugar mill up and running. Um, that also said, I don't really know how much longer this series is going to go. Um, may get to episode 10 and decide that's enough. Um, in short, I don't want you guys to be going, oh boy, this is starting to get awfully repetitive. Um, I am starting to get to that point myself with just simply, you know, I'm trying to get, keep these factories up and running, but it is starting to get quite boring doing the same thing over and over again. So let's unfold the harvester, lower it, and turn it on. Now, now the fun begins of trying to get this, do this. Alright, so, how's it gonna go? Oh, well, it looks to be dumping into the trailer at the very least. Um, it looks as though I'll have, have to come back quite a few times to do different bits and pieces, but, uh, you know, I can't, don't think I'll be able to help that. Um, Alright, so, now, I will put you on to a time lapse. Um, hopefully it won't take three hours for me to get this done. Um, Either way, it won't take that long for you guys, but it'll take a fair while for me. Alright, so, um, as usual, 
See you in a few moments. Okay, even though, even though that was only a 12 minute um, recording session, um, I don't think I'll put either of us through that torture anymore to, while, I, um, while I harvest the rest of that. Um, as you can see, it's a long, slow process. Um, seems like every time I go to talk, one of my animals here needs to make noise too, but anyway. So let's go drop this off, at, off up at the sugar factory um, and get the sugar factory up and running properly, or at least running. Um, and yeah, the, the rest I'll do off camera. Um, as you can see, we've so far got 12,000 odd litres of sugar, um, plus there is more in the um more in the trailer um did not realize how big the trailer actually was so let's get that up and running um okay so we've got we've got that to put in and then we've got to well first of all let's put all the sugar in the sugar cane in uh, so, nope. Go back for that trailer. I'm doing well today, aren't I? Okay, so we'll go back to that trailer. Take that one off. Come around. Drop that one off there. This weight, unfortunately, is a necessary evil. Because if it's not this uh, heavy, then when, if it's not this heavy, then when I um, p try and pick up pallets, the tractor just won't lift. Um, but because it's so heavy, it makes it hard to steer all the time. And I can't just carry tra uh, trailers with it as is. Okay, so... Let's get that into there, which isn't going to make much of a difference, but you know, let, hopefully it'll do something. Um, so I'll get the sugar plant up and running, and I'll do the rest of this off camera. Um, now to get to and pick up, pick that up. So as it will actually start um, start the process. So once again, sorry about my dog's um, snoring in the background. Okay, 
So that's going. Let's just see how that's actually going. The sugar. Yes, we've got sugar production there. So got 12,000 litres of sugar cane. Um, and if you read down there, it's 50% effectiveness with sugar cane, 50% with sugar beets. Um, I'm not doing sugar beets, well, for a while yet. Um, not that they're a waste of time. Um, they're just quite difficult to do. Um, all right. I'll get the rest of this done off camera. Um, for this episode, I think I might call it a day. Um, I don't, as I said, I don't know how many more episodes of this we will do. Um, factories is quite a hard thing to do. Um, it, it is a bit of a difficult one. Um, Please check out my um, the, uh, my farming truckers challenge. Um, I know I changed the rules to suit myself a little bit there. Um, basically, I didn't want to feel like I was cheating the system, so hence I made the loan as large as I possibly could. Um, I think it's a great challenge. Um, I'm enjoying it thoroughly, um, which I suppose is kind of the main important thing um let me know do you want me to keep going with this series um i is happy enough of how um of how much i've oh boy i is happy enough with how many um how the factories have been shown off um yeah, basically, just like animals, you don't have to fulfill every requirement. Um, you know, they do, in this game, they do work, well, in this version of the game, they do work exactly like they do um, in the um, animal pens. Hopefully they will fix, well, I, I'm certain that they will be fixing that in 22, um, just the way everything's looking. Um, I'm a huge fan of the paddock to plate system. Let's go with 12,000. So, all right, well, I'll leave you there. Um, see you, isn't it? Uh, thanks for watching. Um, if you like the video, give us a like. Um, feel free to share and tell your mates about it. Um, all right. Until next time, um, thanks for watching. Cheers.